by the lawmakers where President Jonathan's request to that effect was discussed. Those in favor that the Senate do invoke the powers conferred on it by Section 305, subsections 2 and 6B of the Constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria as amended and approve the proclamation of the state of emergency in Adamawa, Bronu, and Yobe states of Nigeria by the President, Commander in Chief of the Armed Forces of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. I say aye. aye. Those against say nay. The eyes have it. Senator Mark described the decisive action by the federal government as imperative and worthy of support equal to the near state of lawlessness attained in the affected areas. The Senate, he however said, insists that the democratic structures must be allowed to function in the affected states while the Presidential Committee on Amnesty continues its work. I also would like to remind the President, Commander-in-Chief, that the federal government must fund the operations there properly and adequately. As the operation is going on, relief materials and all medical materials should be as quickly as possible moved to the area. We want to appeal to the Boko Haram insurgents and terrorists that is still not too late to cooperate with the forces that are there in Bronu, Adamawa and Yobi State so that we can bring this to a logical conclusion as quickly as possible.